you got to be careful, especially as Guile, because of some of the recent buffs that Aki got, she can bypass projectiles so seamlessly now. And with the training stage, you can understand your spacing so well. Ooh, okay. What are we I'm telling you, Aki is sick, bro. And the fact that she has, you know, a couple of, like, you know, buffs to a little movement options or whatever, it makes it very, very tricky to get a lock on her and the plus frames as well. Are we looking at the seven golden letters for Aki? Reset, gets the puddle off as well. Look for meaty punish counter. What are you reaching at, brother? He's trying. No one's there. <laughs> He wanted to get out. She never is. Every time you think she's in your face, that step back, the slither stance, looks for Tempest, but no dice able to block just in the nick of time thanks to the OD Sonic Boom. Yes, and I'm telling you, this is the, Aki is the character that's like, look, man, if you want to play defensive, go for it. Go for it, bro. We, we can wait here all day. Uh, try to DI to get rid of the, uh, the Sonic Blade right there, but... Nothing going to be found here. Spencer the Savage on Burnout. You have to find a way. The projectiles are getting nullified. The artillery is ineffective. Aki is in your face giving you all the syrup in the corner. I was going to say, you've got to find a way to get out. I love JRO. Jump right out. Wow, that connected. You could see the punch come out from Spencer. It looked like a, just a standing jab that got connected at the very end of the drive impact. And you know what, D-Guy? Recognize and punish. Yep, my magnum opus. Oh, my God, bro. <laughs> hey, that's super <laughs> sick. <laughs> Yo, that's super sick. Let's go. Aki, hey, shout out to all games done quick. Uh, a, a perfect victory and then and then into poison, bro, is... is a perfect victory, yeah. and then just like, right. yo, the really masterful Aki play right there. Aki is is really good. And like, yes. Aki used their Very utility. Uh, shout out Kasa. Um, I, I I was watching Carson has played this character. Ain't no way. Ain't no way. Ain't no way. Wait a way. minute. I, I, I was mid-thought, and I saw a Geef pop up on screen. Savage, are you about to show me something, Savage? We're, we're slamming the red cyclone button. It's like, all right, it went in danger. Press this here to just go right into the geef and you know what shout out bunch bro i was literally just talking about this man <laughs> but going into the geef bro uh, how do you feel about this Ubu? i don't know man so i'm i'm, I'm really high on geef i think geef is so dangerous in that, this meta i think he can take out drive gauges like it's nothing i think the sudden rechange of his standing medium kick is not nearly as bad it's just a matter of how willing are you to play the reversal against Geef in order to get out because just blocking against him, playing the mix-up, and letting him control the tempo is never the wave. This man, G-Guy, bro. Oh. Whoa, whoa. Wake up throw? All right, we're Wake up command grab? SPD on lock. We're jumping in. What are you doing? I, I'm coming. Hey, that, that's enough. <laughs> that is enough. You're not, this is not a platform. <laughs> and you're too damn big, I am, Geef. I am after Four you. Four hops? <laughs> Oh, the sweep gets punished just by a simple sweep and then that headbutt. Yes, this is what we need, bro. You gotta always, set up. Always. You gotta set up the meaties with this character, bro. Um, uh, you better slither out. Nope. Oh, and you? He might just be gone after another. The headbutt again, taking out so much of the driveway and the late knee applying so much pressure. You are in burnout though, so it gave a window for D guy to get out. The knee again does not connect. An opportunity here, especially with Vertical Art online. Yep, trying to go for the buttons here. Doesn't want to risk anything with any, with any like crazy command throws or anything like that. Opt to just go for the low for the low short right here. Very very well done. That's a brick and a half of drive gate. Now you spend three of it in order to follow up on this combo against Geef. Against Geef, Geef has for the most health in the game, man. Like you're you got to be careful with the cast that you spend a nice jump in order to get out of there though. D guy always very aware of the timing of some of these throws. It's just a matter of time before we see that level three get locked. D-Guy thought it was going to be there, but instead he gets a full conversion. The slither out, the no combo, no follow-up. Oh, yeah. Instead, D-Guy gets a chance to cash out. Yeah, you're definitely, if you're not dead, you're definitely at 1%. I think Critical Art would have killed here, but, oh, you might be, you might pass away. But burn, no, no, but sir. More importantly, Burnout is online. You cannot take these fireballs, and you have to jump over them, getting ready for the anti-air. Nicely done, nicely done. But here's the thing, like, Spencer Spencer was cooking with Geef until, he until he decided that Geef was the third Mario character. <laughs> he was jumping a lot. You gotta, you gotta just relax. The thing that's scary about Zane Geef, right, and I think you can agree with this, right. Google. Uh, I'm gonna pivot over to Station 1 real quick, but continue your thought. Yeah, the yeah. thing that's scary...